What's up, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls? Your boy, the Dreadman, is back, and I just want to give you guys my quick thought slash reaction on the 2019 Lion King teaser trailer. Now, I seen it yesterday with a friend while I was eating Thanksgiving dinner, and um, mind you, I was already sold when the movie came out, but once I seen the trailer, <sighs> oh my god. I don't need any more convincing. I mean, and of course people are like, well, this is a remake. I don't know why you're so excited to see it. But the thing is, like, we get to see a live action slash CDI a adaptation of it. And, I mean, of course they're going to rehash some things. They're going to do cer cer some things different to appeal to new audiences. But, of course, they're going to keep the story. And they're going to keep a lot of the elements and some of the key parts of the movie the same. At least from what I know. But the teaser trailer, I mean, it's already a 10 out of 10 on the teaser trailer. So, I mean, I'm already sold on it. Now... Here's the thing. I mean, Disney, in the next year or two, like from now to like 2020, 2021, Disney's going to be doing some big things in the next two to, two to three years. And they're, aside from Toy Story, Toy Story 4 coming out next summer, Disney already has four live-action CGI remakes in the works. Dumbo, Aladdin. Mulan, but that's still in development stages. That's coming out in like 2020, I believe. And of course, we got The Lion King. Now, Disney, you listen here. You listen and you listen good. You have the childhood of every single 80s, 90s, and 2000s babies born worldwide. Millions and millions of us worldwide who've been born within the past 35 years. Our hopes and dreams and expectations of this movie is riding on your shoulders. This was a childhood defining movie for us. Don't mess this up. They can, I mean, Disney, I trust you, and a lot of us trust you because, I mean, you define our childhoods with these movies. But yeah, a lot of these movies, they can easily be messed up. But like I said, I've got faith, so I'm not gonna, you know, down the movie. I'm not, I'm not gonna down it before I see it, but like I said, I'm already sold. And I got faith in Latin, the live action Latin remake. I got faith in the, well, I still might need a little bit of convincing on the Dumbo remake, but I'm still going to see it anyway, even though that was a 1950s movie. But still, it was a, it was a uh, movie that defined a lot of uh, a lot of our childhoods. And the Mulan movie, there's you know that's you know more more to develop on that, but still. And um, but yeah, that's pretty much all I got to say about that. I loved it. I mean, for any, everybody who saw it, what do you think of it? And anyway, uh, this has been the Dreadman. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.